Hey what's up creative people welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop tutorial in this tutorial I will teach you how to make a spread dripping effect in Photoshop so let's begin so first of all what can I do I just needed this type of picture and I also removed this background so I can select the rectangle marker tool or it and then I select the select and mask then make sure you actually select the quick selection tool and you get this uh, option called select subject and click it it's take a few seconds to select your subject and remove your background very easily but sometimes it's wor it's not work perfectly so we, we, we can do is manual process so make sure here is some unselected portion of your picture so I'm just uh, uh, select this portion and delete it by manual so I am using polyglanar laser tool then select it and zoom it what is you need so I'm just using and make sure you press the alter button so that you can actually remove your object very easily all right now we click the ok and you are remove your background very easily so it's already complete your you can remove your background very easily now what can you do just uh, move your portion is a main campus here is my main campus and resize it so I'm just resize my picture according to my canvas all right now I'm just using a dripping print uh, PNG which is I also provide in a description you're gonna actually need it you just download and apply your Photoshop so you actually move your main campus and resize it according to your photo then click layer and you actually get the normal to lighten then boom it's actually give a really good effect so I just used to this effect according to my photo I think it's look really good yep. Yep, it looked really good and you also add a splash pin effect in your photo so move your picture and just zoom out and resize it according to your picture and it's also go to your background boom it's look also Then what can you do you just select all the layer shape and merge it merge layer and you actually make sure you select the black and then you go to gradient overlay and little bit gradient effect in apply your picture gonna copy this option and then hit ok and boom it's ready to go and look at the uh, this is a really easy step to make this effect in a Adobe Photoshop so if you are new here and if you are watching the first time in this video in my channel make sure you do subscribe my channel and smash the bell button and I hope you it's very easy to apply in Adobe Photoshop 
e-tutorials and it's helpful for you thanks for watching